and it's just easier to like really get the hair in because my hair is kind of thick and I'm tired. <laughs> Welcome back to my channel today i'm going to be showing you how i get my hair nice and sleek and looking snatched okay it's super easy super cheap and it looks just like how you get it done in the salon if you want to see how i get this hairstyle go ahead and keep on watching all right so we're gonna get into it right now my hair is semi dirty semi dry and isn't that crazy? I'm gonna take my spray bottle and just wet up the front parts. I love this spray bottle, by the way. It's like a continuous spray. So you just hold it down and just kind of like gives you like a nice even distribution of water. <laughs> so, get a little wet. That's what she said. Like, I, I feel like this style is the be best when it's your hair has already kind of got product in it. Not when it's like fresh. I feel like when your hair is fresh, it's kind of harder to really mold it down how you want it to be. So having it a little bit dirty just helps with the molding process and just making sure that the hair is going to be nice and sleek. Or like I'm not going to do like a kind of like a slicked up. It's going to be kind of like mid, midway. So you can still see the pony, but it's not going to be like right on top of my head. So I kind of have it where I want it, what position I want it to be in. And I like to take headbands to tie my hair up instead of scrunchies or hair ties um, because I feel like the elasticity on these are a lot better and it's just easier to like really get the hair in because my hair is kind of thick and I'm tired it's easier to get the all of the hair that you want to get inside of these things I'm going to be taking some Gorilla Snot. You can get this from Target. You can get this at your local beauty supply. They sell it at Walmart. I think they even sell it at like CVS. So you can get it a lot of places. I love this. This is my favorite stuff. I'm telling you guys, it molds the hair exactly how you want it. It is the best stuff ever. It's just a little messy, but I don't even care about that because it really just molds the hair like how you want it to be. So that's all that matters. Take some from my back part of my head too. Like that much. Do the same back here. Even though I can't really see what I'm doing back here. I have an, a good idea. Okay, and then I'm going to take another scrunchie. Just make sure this is nice and tight. Then I'm going to take a little bit of whatever hair is left out. And just brush through this. Now, if you have longer hair than me, you don't really have to worry about this part. But since my hair is a little bit on the short side still, I'm just going to have to hide my little ponytail that I got going on here. I'm just going to kind of like do a little fake braid situation. So I'm just going to take my little scrunchie right here. This one will come out. I wish I had a darker one, but I don't know what I did with my other scrunchie. I'm just going to continue to kind of make sure that all this is in place. Sometimes I get a little bit of flyaways, but we're going to control that in a second. I'm going to start working on my baby hers. And just take my little brush. I got this from the beauty supply store. Actually, I got this sent to me. I got this from Evolve. They have a bunch, bunch of cute little edge brushes. I'm just going to take a little bit of water to reactivate it again, just so it makes it easier to control the baby hairs. And sometimes I'll take a little bit of Gorilla Snot to keep them from lifting and going away. Now that I'm done with my baby hairs, I'm going to take some wrapping paper. Now this is completely optional, but this is where I find that I get the best results with my hair 
and just it laying really, really nice and flat. Just wrapping this around really tight. Now, sometimes if I have time, I'll sit under a blow dryer. But if I don't have time, I just use a hair blow dryer, portable one that works too. Actually, I wanna take this under here. I got this ponytail, this wraparound ponytail from my local beauty supply here in Florida. Um, it's from the company Shake and Go, and this is the Super Curl 32 inch Pony Pro in the color number two. The curl pattern, I love this, it's so pretty. Like, I like just how like natural it looks. I only have one comb in this, in this particular one, but I kind of like that because it just makes it easier to kind of like manipulate it how you want to. Um, doesn't have any combs in the back has a little bit of space to like kind of hide the hair that's underneath. And so what I'm gonna do is take the comb and secure it right like so. And then I just take it under and just start wrapping. It has like this one long piece of hair here. Start wrapping. So that's pretty secure. So I'm just gonna use my blow dryer to blow dry this, make it sure it gets, you know, dry quicker instead of sitting in the blow dryer. All right, so. Blow dry that for a little bit. Now my ear is all red. Bring looking nice and sleek. I feel like with the best results, you would definitely want to, you know, sit under a blow dryer, but if you can't, a hand blow dryer works just the same, especially using the Gorilla Snot. It's like the best result. but that is it. This is how I get my little sleek ponies. Super simple, super easy, and I love that I have these new wraparounds, they're so much easier to use. They're a lot easier to make that kind of salon perfect pony. If you enjoyed watching this video, please give me a thumbs up. Also, if you're not subscribed to my channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Make sure you hit that bell so you get the notifications when I post videos. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.